Welcome to the instructions for setting up the NewerTech wireless aluminum keypad. The first thing we'll need to do is insert the batteries into the keypad. To do this, look at the right hand side of the keypad. The battery compartment cover has large slot across it. Use a coin or similar item to unscrew the cap, then slide the batteries in positive terminal first. You can then replace the cap and your keypad is ready to pair with your computer. This keypad can work with any Bluetooth compatible computer. Though the steps for your particular setup may vary slightly, the basic process is the same. First, make sure you have Bluetooth turned on. Usually there is a menu bar item that will allow you to toggle it on and off. Push and hold the power button on the left hand side of the keypad until the light under the equals key flashes blue. Then, open your Bluetooth preferences and find the aluminum number pad from your list of devices. All you need to do is choose to pair the device, and after a moment, it'll be recognized by your computer. If you're using an Apple Bluetooth keyboard, you can attach the NewerTech Wireless Aluminum keypad using the included bracket. With the rounded end facing down, slide the left side of the keypad into the right side of the bracket until it sits flush. Then, do the same with the right side of the keyboard. If you want to have a more permanent connection between the keypad and the keyboard, flip the keyboard over and remove the adhesive tabs from their envelope. Simply peel one of the tabs off and place it on the bottom of the unit so that it can hold the two pieces together securely. Flip the assembly over and your Apple keyboard and newer tech keypad can now be used as a single unified unit. Your newer tech wireless aluminum keypad is now ready to use.